Collagen peptides have exploded in popularity because of their benefits for our skin, but there's been a question about which source of collagen peptides is most effective, and a new study has just helped to answer it. Researchers noticed that the existing studies used collagen from fish or pigs, so they wanted to investigate the effects of collagen from cows instead, and the study included 66 women aged between 35 and 55, and it lasted 8 weeks. They looked at collagen's impact in terms of wrinkle volume around the eyes plus elasticity and skin hydration. And they used precision equipment to make these measurements, so they weren't just guessing during the study. For eye wrinkles, they assessed the change in the volume of one individual wrinkle and tested that at the 4-week mark and at the 8-week mark. For skin elasticity, they precisely measured how quickly the skin returned to normal after being stretched. And they assessed hydration using a device that measures how well the top layer of the skin can hold an electric charge. So when the skin is more hydrated, the charge holds better. So what were the trial results? Well, let's start with the eye wrinkle volume. When they checked at the 4-week mark, it had decreased by about 9% compared to the placebo group. But at the 8-week mark, the reduction was an impressive 25%. One person even had a reduction of 51%. What about skin elasticity? Well, this improved by 6% at the 4-week mark and 9% by the end of the study. Finally, they also saw benefits in terms of hydration. By 8 weeks, it had increased by 26% in the group taking collagen peptides compared to the placebo group. So how does this study shed light on the critical question of which source of collagen is best? Well, unlike previous studies that used fish or pork, researchers in this study used collagen from cows, yet the impact of the supplements was similar. This led the study authors to a novel conclusion. It doesn't look like the effectiveness of collagen peptides depends upon the animal source from which they come. 